Andy Holt, performance analyst for the Irish Women's National Team. So um, I did a sports science degree in DCU um, and as part of that degree I did a, I did a one semester module in performance analysis um, and I kind of just fell in love with it from there. Um, in my third year in DCU I, I did an internship. I, I got in with Jared Dunn who's the, who's the head performance analyst in the FAI um, and I've been there ever since. Uh, so the main bits of equipment we need, we have two cameras at every training session, one to record goalkeepers, one to record the uh, main training session itself. Two tripods so uh, we, ha we have a bit of height on the gantry. We would also use um, a GoPro so we get the, the, tactical, the tactical view of the, of the pitch. In the morning we'd ha have our staff meeting first so um, all the backroom staff would, would meet up uh, normally around nine or half nine um, to discuss what's happening through, uh, for the rest of the day and discuss how, how the previous day went. So myself and Eileen would then put together clips for on opposition analysis um, based on what the team meeting will be that evening. So uh, we more or less look at the four functions, um, attack and defend and transition to attack, transi transition to defend. Um, so uh, depending on what the team meeting is that night, we would we would have uh, Germany analysed. Um, in their, we'd probably look back at their last 10 games and have clips from, the, from those games that, that best suit. For a training session, um, what I would do is record the full session. Um, basically, that's what I do at the training session. But after that, we would go back um, and analyze the training session. So we'd, we'd look at the, the different patterns of play, the different uh, drills, and, and just analyze. And then we'd give feedback to, to players uh, individually or in a group, um, if needs be. Post-training, um, we would try and link it up with the analysis we've done on Germany. So. Um, what we would do is have a look at, at Germany before before the training session. Um, say if we're if we're looking at their transition to defend, um, we would we'd look how we can exploit in our transition to attack. Um, so we're trying to look at key areas where we can where we can exploit the opposition. Probably the most challenging is just the amount of footage you have to actually go through. Um, to analyse the, the opposition team especially, um, you have to look back at hours and hours of footage. Probably the most rewarding is, is that, that feeling when you get a good result uh, on game day. There, nothing, nothing beats a, a good result. It's, it's brilliant, so it is.